guys, good morning and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another vlog. Dude, today is a super exciting day because, first of all, I get to drive this thing. Uh, but not only do I get to drive it, but I get to drive it all the way to Beverly Hills. Yep, that's right, we're heading to GI Automotive. Anthony is actually waiting for us over there. Well, he's probably not even awake yet, but uh, by the time I get there, he should be awake and ready to go. Valley View. So dope this morning. Starbucks was closed, boys. Monster it is. Got the swing on eco mode pretty much. Sounds like an electric car. Blowing leaves out the back. So we just rolled up to GI Automotive. Um, I'm actually at the red light, but it's freaking law here dude i don't i i have to wear this mask um it's crazy so he had warned me actually before i came that they're actually enforcing this it's like a thousand dollar fine if you don't have a mask on so we have to wear a mask here we are there's anthony right there How you doing? Good man, how are you? Mask life. Yeah, I'm mask life, dude. Do I know. Man, oh, yeah, I'm excited. How's she excited. running? She runs really good, dude. Actually, right now we just got uh, the air brake fault. Remember how we were talking about that? Yep. We just got that. Um, I forgot to tell you too, I've, I was watching a video. I had seen they're resetting it by like pulling it up and, put, and putting it down. Have you seen that? Yep. Okay, and that seemed to work for like a week. Yeah. And I literally just told him about it kind of jinxed myself yeah, I think. That's unfortunately but. one of the one of the magical little nagging issues of the 12C yeah. is the uh, air brake thing. Uh, but yeah you can manually reset it, push it down and then I think that the other trick is to push and hold the air brake button okay. before or after you start it up for 10 seconds okay. which should also do it. We'll take a look at that and I think that wing has probably got something else in store for it right? Yeah. Today dude. it's spring day. Spring day. Are you excited? I'm excited yeah dude. Get Bring this, this thing, thing lowered. Down. Finally first mod like I told you guys first mod for the 12C. Uh, super excited the start of the GT3 yeah, dude. version. Super pumped. All right, here's the springs right here. Let's unbox this thing. Down here. Yeah. Uh, the uh, agency boxes, power. Boxes. boxes on boxes. Uh, For a second, I only saw two in the box. I was uh, freaking out a little <laughs> yeah, bit. I know, me too. I'm like, oh shit, I should have opened the box before uh, <laughs> Gabe got here because it would have been shit if you just had <laughs> yeah, two, it right? That's good. It's like uh, Easter are present good. around here. Ah, oh, look at those. Yeah, these things are dope. This thing's gonna fit so perfect. So I think it's a 25 millimeter drop in the front and 30 in the back, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, nice, nice. That'll start. Perfect. So look at the difference between the stock one and what we're putting on right now, or what they're putting on. It's insane. That's, yeah, that's, uh, it looks a lot more than it is, but when it's compressed, it'll be 25 mils in the front, 30 in the back. 25, 30 in the rear. Yeah. Dope. Sick, yeah. You don't need to wipe it down, I know. No, I'm just sanitizing it. <laughs> I have a little hand sanitizer in it too. You never know, right? Yeah, you never know. Social distancing too. Yeah. So my nephew's big into like BMW. Amber is one of the owners of GI Automotive. If you guys didn't know, that's Amber there. <laughs> oh, lucky for her, BMW apparently uh, loans her cars like every month or every whatever. Well, she's got this M8 competition right here that was loaned to her from BMW. And uh, she just offered my nephew to go take a drive in it. Ike, you're gonna want a new car. <laughs> <laughs> Where's full drift mode? <laughs> <laughs> so you can actually turn like the all-wheel drive option somehow. Probably M mode. M mode. Sport. So there you can choose road, sport, track. Look at the interior in this thing. That's so dope. Can't literally can't even sit anybody back there. But there's a back seat. This cop's gonna get pulled over by a parking enforcement <laughs> right there. Oh, 
That's so dope. Oh, goodness. So there it is. If you guys want a BMW M8 competition, this thing's sick. Hello, what can I help you with? Nothing. There we go. Now we know how to drive it. <laughs> yeah, this is torquey. Yeah, it's so torquey. <laughs> Parking enforcement. got it on track mode I think oh yeah oh look that's where you change everything yeah now you can change it from here to there like you can do sport uh, you can adjust efficient sport plus so you can adjust the suspension the steering the brakes it's insane you can literally like tune the whole car here oh it's so <laughs> sick it's so bad stock brand new it's stock That's so dope. You don't even need an exhaust in this thing. It's so dope. Back to GI yeah, and the fun ends. Cool. So they finished the car, dropping it. See how low this thing sits now. Damn. Holy <laughs> shit. Dude, look at the front. Oh my god, look at this, dude. It's not even off the rack yet. God damn. I think that's so sick. Some ripper spacers, too. Yeah. Not a lot of room. Probably bring out like 10 millimeters. Yeah, run a 12 inch wide in the rear. And... Oh, yeah. How's she sitting? On to step two. Yep, on to step two. What do you think should be next, wing? Yes, we're actually gonna poke around and take a peek and see what we're gonna do about the stock upright hydraulic uh, actuators. Uh -huh. And then start our hunt for the uh, GT3 wing. We're thinking about going with Liberty Walk wing. It's the most, I don't know, sexy wing that we were able That's to find. That's pretty outrageous, right? Yeah. For a fixed chassis mount uh, yeah. Yeah. out the rear end wing. It's probably the best looking one too. Yeah, um, it's that option or we just go with the kind of post mounted version of what the, is actually on a GT3 on a GT3 12 c right? Yeah. Get someone to custom fab that for us. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Rear diffuser coming in. Oh, yeah, gotta do rear diffuser. Yeah. Oh.
final thoughts? Looks amazing, dude. I'm excited to see how you find the ride with this much low in your daily driving. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty low. Daily dude. driving. That's, my driveway is the one that's going to... That'll be the true test? It rubbed stock. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Thank God you have those yeah. skid plates. Yeah. Yep. Cool, so. man. All righty. So what's next? When am I going to see you next? What are we doing next? I don't know. A week or two? A week or two? The wing? The wing? I think we, sh I think we need to get the wing and done. And exhaust. And exhaust done. Well, great. Well, let me know and we'll go from there and okay. get that going and explore options uh, with the fixed wing. Yeah. Sounds good, man. All right. So, so this is yeah. All right, dude. Welcome to Beverly Hills. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I know. All right, man. <laughs> Well, thanks again. You're very welcome, I'll see guys. You guys. Have a safe drive. All right. Nice to meet you. See you. Rainbow Tins. I seriously thought I was getting pulled over for too low, but uh, nope, it was window tents. Like always, should be used to this one. And finally, been waiting all damn drive to do that. Made it home, boys. Let's see how this thing did. Dude, honestly, coming up the hill, so like coming up this hill right here, um, where I live, obviously, uh, we have speed bumps. I seriously thought I was probably gonna get stuck on the speed bump, gonna have to call for help or something, but no, we made it. Uh, this thing is hammered. Look at this. It is, uh, it's, it looks so much better though, honestly. Like, to tell you the truth, like this is exactly what, uh, oh, tail light's working, by the way. Um, they did end up fixing it. it. We thought it went out again, but it didn't. So, um, but look at this. Dude, this is insane. I thought it was just gonna cover the wheel gap. And uh, nope, that was not the case here. The case here was, I don't know, go low or go home. And we did both. We went low and we came home. So. Anyways, guys, if you made it this far in the video, thank you guys so much. You guys, please, big, big shout out to GI Automotive, Anthony at Mad Whips, dude. Thank you so much. Um, seriously, guys, this build has officially started. I'm super stoked. You guys don't even know what the hell is going to come to this car. Like, uh, the plans for this thing is just going to be outrageous. Like, it's going to be a straight legal race look alike car and uh have some big plans for it so i'm super excited i'm gonna end this vlog right here so hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog there's gonna be plenty more to come so guys please help me out smash that subscribe button like squad as always smash the like button and always remember what we think we become have a good night peace